What's up, you guys? Marty Schwartz here with Marty Music. Excited to break this song down for you guys. Uh, some cool acoustic stuff going on with it. Also, thanks so much for supporting Marty Music. I really appreciate you subscribing, clicking the bell notification. Plus, if you look in the description below, I have links and other ways so you can help decide what songs I teach, free courses, all kinds of stuff to help you get playing guitar. All right, let's break it down. All right, so you're going to put the capo on the first fret. You're going to take an A minor chord. And you're going to start the strum, uh, but the intro, he does a little lick. So. And so I'm sliding third fret up from the capo with my ring finger. Third fret up. One, two, three, on the B string with my ring finger. Up a whole step, and then I grab that one, two, third fret up on the high E, and they ring out together. So that slides and keeps ringing like that. So check it out. does a quick second pick on that uh, third fret high E. And then you're going to use your index finger and do a quick slide from three to one on the B string. And right as you do that, you're going to start to get that C chord, C chord ready. That finger's already there. But if you can, get your ring finger on that third fret A string and your middle finger is going to go going to add that later, so check it out. One more time. So then it does the lick again. And this time it's immedi immediately an A minor chord. So you put both together, it starts with A minor. Lick. Right into A minor. And then into the first one again. And that's that intro. So then we get to the part that's called the verse, and it's A minor, G, and C, and then... So if you look at the C, so you got one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, and the rhythm. So that do do da do do da da do da that's on that C chord. the second time. So he's singing a third time. And now on the fourth repeat, instead of C, we go to F, which I'm playing it that way. You can play it that way or that way. Uh, and even the high E's ringing out there. So that last one, Starts over again, A minor, G, and C. And he's doing a little melody singing here. It does a second one. But then once the form of the verse comes in again, it does the exact same thing into what we would call the chorus. So it would, it would do, when the verses come in, it would do three of these. On the 
fourth one. Into the chorus. So the chorus goes like this. It's very similar to what we were already doing. Little differences. So it goes, the first one is A minor, G, C, just like we've been playing. But then the next one is G, F, C, A minor again, G, F, C. And then the final one, A minor, G, into where it builds up to the next piece. So, just to recap, the chorus is A minor, G, C, but then A minor, G, F, C, A minor, G, F, C, and then A minor, G, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, three, two. And then there's a new guitar part that gets in there as well over that groove, A minor, G, and C, which is basically what we were thinking of as the verse. All right, the line now, the first phrase. That's the first one. So we're sliding from third fret on the B up to the fifth fret. And then that third fret high E. Then you're going right back to the three slide up to the five. So check it out. So slide. Slide, and then back to that one again. So three, then five on the B. Then you're gonna hit that five again, and immediately as you pick slide down a whole step to that first fret, C, well, capo, but first fret, so. Starts the same way. But then now we go up to the five on the high E to three, so. Then from five on the B, slide down a whole step. So. So I'm pulling that, sliding to the first one. And so then it goes back to just a variation of the first one. between the uh, three and the one. And then the open high E there. So you put them all together. All right, now we have the bridge section and we're gonna start with a D minor now to a G. And then A minor. Waited. A minor to C, then F to C. And then it starts over. So check it out. D minor to G. Then A minor. 
weighted C, F, C. And then finally, the third time, it's just D minor. So those are all the parts you're going to need for the song. Just look out for the double chorus that happens. You know, which is that A minor, G, C, but then A minor, G, F, C, and then that again. But it's exactly like the form we worked on. there was the lesson once again thank you so much for hanging out with me for this and if you made it this far congratulations <laughs> anyway uh, you can uh, request tunes or lessons you'd like to see in the comments below and while you're down there don't forget to like and subscribe right here to marty music thank you again so much i can't wait to see you again later take care ah!